and welcome back to the second video of the More From The In-Depth series. And as I promised, I will talk about Nightwish, the earliest, and I will present more albums from the Tarja and Annette period. Make yourself sure to stay till the end because I will have a great gift pack for the luckiest of you. So as I told you in my first Nightwish video, I had the opportunity to see them two times live with Tarja, and what I didn't tell you was that I saw them again in Hungary in 2008 with Annette. If you haven't seen my first Nightwish video, click the end screen link and it will send you to it. The show was cool, I liked it, but it was a bit different from the ones I got used to. Actually, here are some bad quality pictures and even worse quality live recordings for you guys, but come on, it was 2008 and I had just a 6 megapixel camera back then. Let's take a look at them. Okay, don't tell me I didn't warn you. Bottom line, I enjoyed the show and I enjoyed much more the songs which were written for Annette's voice. It was a cool experience and I'm very grateful for it. Some of these CDs have actually 20 years or more. Man, 20 years, time flies. Anyway, all of these CDs are in dual tag except one, this, which is in Digitag. So let me tell you briefly to what we will take a closer look in a moment. Actually, our old albums during the Tarja and Annette period, starting with Angels Fall First up to Imaginarium. And between these are The Wishmaster, The Oceanborn, Century Child, Over the Hills of Far Away, Dark Passion Play, and some EPs, and I even have a DVD End of an Era. Such a cool collection, isn't it? And now, sit back and relax because we will take a closer look to all of these one by one. Here is the Angels Fall First CD. This is a remastered edition with a bonus track, A Return to the Sea, and its lyrics we can find under the CD. The booklet is signed by Tarja and it has 8 unfoldable pages through which we can find all the lyrics and on the other side is the tracklist, credits and a picture of the band. It is a cool debut album and my favorite song from this one is Album Pad. The second one is the Oceanborn CD, under it is an artwork of the ocean. The booklet has 12 pages and contains all the lyrics with cool artwork. I got it signed by Tarja. And on the last page we have a cool picture of the band. My favorite song from this one is Swan Heart. Next is Wishmaster with a damaged case. The booklet has 16 pages, contains all the lyrics and is signed by Tarja. And the middle is unfoldable, containing a cool picture of the band. My favorite track is Wanderlust, but it's a hard choice. Next one is Century Child Album, we have a cool picture under the CD. The CD has a tracklist on it, along with the cover artwork. 
The booklet has 16 pages, contains all the lyrics and the picture of each band member. Tarya's picture is signed by her. Here we have the vinyl of the same album, it's a double black disc edition. This is the sleeve of the first disc with a magical picture and the lyrics of the first disc. The first disc has 8 songs, 4 on each side. On the front of the second disc sleeve is a full picture of the band and some words written by Thomas and on the back we have the lyrics of the second disc. The disc has 7 songs, 2 on side C and 5 on side D. And my all time favorite song is on this album and it is Everdream. Next is a compilation, Highest Hopes. The booklet is again signed by Tarja and it has 12 pages with a cool picture at the center. And it has almost all the lyrics except Walking in the Air, Over the Hills and Far Away and High Hopes, which is a Pink Floyd cover. My favorite from this one is Dead Boy's Poem, it's a masterpiece. And here is the first album with Annette, Dark Passion Play. It is a 2 CD edition and as we open the digipack we see a beautiful picture of the band. To the left we have the actual album and under it we have a quote by Walt Whitman and to the right we have the instrumental version of the album and the pocket with the booklet in it. And here is the great booklet with 24 pages and it has a lot of pictures, artworks and the lyrics. My favorite from this album is Eva. This is the imaginary model. The booklet has 24 pages. It is a masterpiece, very beautiful pictures and all the lyrics. The picture of the band members brings the circus and the amusement park feeling. My favorite from this album is Rest Calm. Next one is Imaginarium the Score. We have the CD with the tracklist on it. The booklet has 16 pages filled with lots of great pictures and on the last page we have the credits.
Here is the Over the Hills and Far Away album with the nice artwork. The booklet is signed by Daria and it has 8 pages with the lyrics of 3 songs and can be unfolded to reveal a map where the band had shows. And the cassette with the same songs and same booklet in compact smaller size. My favorite song from this one is Away. This is the Sleeping Sun DVD from 2005. The booklet has 4 pages and contains a picture and the lyrics of Sleeping Song. Next is Bless the Child EP, again, nice picture on and under the sea. The booklet has 4 pages and contains all the lyrics, my favorite song from this one is Night Quest. And the second to last is the Cider EP, cool artwork on the CD. The booklet has 4 pages and it is signed again by Talia and contains the lyrics of the cider. And finally, here is the limited edition of End of an Era with a DVD with the show and two CDs. As we open the pack to the left, we have the DVD containing the entire show, a 55 minute documentary, and a picture gallery. As we unfold it again, we discover the two CDs which contain the tracks from the show, total of 18 tracks. This show is beautiful, and also a sad one, we all know why. This is a ticket replica of the show. and the 16-page booklet with two pictures. And now at the end I will add the missing pictures of the back of the CDs. Okay, this was it. Are you still there? Tell me in the comment how did you enjoy the time travel. Okay, I know it's not an easy test, but if you would like to win the gift pack I will present in a moment, you have to tell me in the comment down below which was your favorite. I will start. My favorite was Highest Hopes because it's a great compilation and it contains almost all of my favorite songs. And now the gift pack which is made of two very personal items which I will give to the luckiest of you. So the first item is a real leather bracelet which was made to my request and it has the Century Child logo on it. It has at least 15 years. 
The second one, it's even an older item. It is a print of a photo I took of Talia in 2005 and I got it signed three months later before a show. So if you would like this so if you would like these two items, you have to do exactly what I told you before. You have precisely three days for this, after which I will make a live recording and I will extract the lucky name. This time I hope the live recording will be better than last time. With all this being said, take care, I wish you good luck, see you in my next video and don't forget, all you need is love and the record player. Bye.